Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how you can open the Sentinel-2 Cloudless Mosaic, the annual Mosaic developed by a company called EOX and offered through the URL s2maps.eu. This company offered this Cloudless Maps, Sentinel-2 Maps, which can be used as a very nice base maps in your QGIS uh, projects. Um, they offer it as WMS service, web map services. And if you go to, in this URL, if you go to um, about this, about services from this company, you can see that they are mentioning about um, the WMTS and WMS web map tile service and web map service offered by this company. So the first point, the first part, if you want to work with the WMS in QGIS is to get the WMS server link. So if you click on this link, you can see that it will go to this WMS server and list the capabilities of that server in an XML format. What you need is the entry point to the server, which is the link up to here. I will copy this part and I will open QTS, a blank project. Then to focus on a certain area, I will go to um, vector and add a boundary. In this case, I add a boundary of Egypt. I'll go to the properties, make the field transparent, add a brighter color here. Now here is the Egypt boundary. Now I want to add the Sentinel-2 satellite image as a base map without downloading or processing it. So what I will do is I'll go to layer, add layer, and add WMS or WMTS layer. So I click on that, it will open such a uh, user interface. You go to the layers tab. You can already see that I'm connected to Sentinel WMS, but I will to showcase it in the video. I will show you how to create a new service connection. I'll go to new. I will give a name to this connection. You can give any name, uh, give a sensible name, Sentinel2. And in the URL, I will paste the URL, which I copied from uh, this particular link and I will say okay that's it then once you have the sentinel tool you can see in this list all the WMS connections which you have made and this is the new sentinel 2 connection which I have just made I will select that and I will click on connect then it will connect communicate with the um, server and list all the layers available as WMS you can see that there are many layers available. Uh, there is OSM OpenStreetMap, there is coastline, uh, there are some streets available, terrain available. But what is more interesting is the Sentinel-2 cloudless maps. And you can see that it is available annually from 2016 to 2020. So I'm going to check, and you can also see these each year, these are available in two coordinate systems. One is EPSG4326, which is latitude longitude geographical system and the other one is the Mercator system used by Google. So I'm going to open the Sentinel-2 Cloudless 2020 and add it here. You can see it's already added. I will also add 2019, press on add, close. You can see it is already came in uh, the QGIS project. Remember for WMS service to work, you should be always connected to internet. Without internet, it won't work. You can. Uh, get the Egypt boundary on top. You can zoom in uh, to the Sentinel um, to the Sentinel 2 base map and you can clearly see uh, many details because Sentinel 2 is around 10 to 20 meter resolution and it's very nice uh, to see the zoomed in areas, especially in the agriculture areas. It clearly shows the spatial heterogeneity. Hope it's clear to you. And uh, thank you very much for watching.